um, property taxes have increased by 6% this year. Uh, so there's an expectation that City Hall gets the work done. Um, I have a hard time telling hardworking taxpayers of Hamilton uh, that such an increase in their property taxes, uh, that we're too busy to solve the issue of homelessness. Uh, this is a big issue, yes, and it will take a big effort comprised of many small actions. This is what people expect. I find this motion uh, problematic. Pace with now is not a consequence of anybody's um, moral failing. It's not going to be caused or solved rather by an act of individual benevolence. It is a deeply flawed housing and health system. I object to the sentiment behind this motion. Um, and I, I will not and I cannot support it. Thank you. What I think this motion does is say, you know, let's, let's look at the situation. Let's look at where there might be some other opportunities and let's not shut the door uh, on anything. And so I get it that there's some, um, I think, ideological perspective that comes in to some of this conversation. I think we need to be solution oriented. If it doesn't work, uh, if it's not something that we can provide the resources for as a municipality, we'll hear that from staff. If in this conversation there is a faith organization that steps up to the plate to perhaps undertake some kind of a matching uh, program program or service uh, and undertaking the liability uh, of such, then, then we'll end up there. But shutting the door to any conversation, assuming that, that the solutions are only the ones that we already know about and or the people that we're talking about are certain people, I think actually speaks to some of the debate that we've had uh, on other topics around this table or rather on other agenda items around the same topic around this table. So I am going to take a leap of faith uh, and, and ask uh, and support this just to get the information. 